Now that we've created our session, let's go ahead and set it up. The first thing I'd recommend doing is to go to your setup, in out settings, and just make sure that your audio interface is showing up here at the top of the input tab and also that Pro Tools is showing the inputs on the list to the left. As you can see in my situation, I've got an audio interface that has 16 inputs, but I don't have any showing up on the list. To fix this, I'm simply going to press default and you can see that Pro Tools went ahead and mapped out all of the inputs to be available within Pro Tools. I'm also going to check this on the outputs. And again, the same situation. I only have two outputs listed here when I have 16 available. So again, I'm going to press default. And once I see that mapped out the way I want it, I'm going to go ahead and choose OK.